Hello everyone, welcome back with our SPS video. Today we're back on Lunar SPS, the biggest custom server day. And today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to continue our beautiful from scratch grinds. I'm super, super excited. Fast, six, fast. The giveaway is going to be a gold card package. One lucky winner. All you have to do with that one is like the video, comment, check your name down below, and be subscribed to my channel. If you guys haven't checked the Lunar, make sure to do so. The links are down below. And when you guys are looking for the first time, you should type Colin Grumpy Fan to the chat. And with the code Walkers, you guys will be getting a very nice talent pack. So make sure claiming that one. And I would say, let's get right into the grinds. We have two times drops for like six more minutes. I probably lost a couple of globals right here, but look at there's a beautiful garden spawn right here. If there's two times drop, there's a lot of times these bad boys are spawning right here. Let's see what we gotta be getting. Come on. Give me some loot nine pieces right here. Two times, please, game. Come on. Oh, oh wait, wait, wait a second. Nope, nope, nope. We didn't get anything. Very unfortunate, but not too shabby. We just killed another guardian. Come on. Get me spooked, buddy. What do we got? Antigua, I'm 20 of those. And that's pretty much it right here. Of course, my man Mingwen. Wingman right here gets a drop. Shout out to him. Another guardian spawn right here. This is freaking madness. Three more minutes. We might have even another one after this one. I have a good feeling. Time to get spooked. The bad boy is dead. And zero to... Oh, no. We don't get shit again. Well... 50k, I guess. I'll take. So, we're gonna open a beautiful Xenite casket as per usual for the tradition of the series, right? Hey, good luck to us. Let's see what we're gonna be getting. Come on, spoon me. For the love of God, I'll take two diamonds for sure. Right, here we go. Time to get the freaking casket merchant scroll. 50. Oh, I'll take. Okay, I mean, that's one mil. We'll take that. Come on. Give me, give me, give me. Oh, that's the fucking worst we could have gotten. That's an F. Today is gonna be Sunday evening gauntlet grind, right here. Um, it's a mini game that's brand new. It's the latest mini game that was released. You want to teleport to mini games? Gauntlet right here. It's pretty FKly. You kind of need very high DPS to do this properly. And we're gonna go and do this for like I don't know, half an hour, maybe one hour, and see how much loot we can actually gather from that. But it's actually very straightforward. I've unlocked beginners. You go in there, you start attacking. You just want to put soul split on, and then you're essentially just chilling. Besides the workout wave, where you're gonna go ahead and freaking uh get this all split removed but even then if you have a quiver you should be quite all right you can use all the boosters pot up the highest cps possible and then you're good to go so that's the next wave front here it took me quite a bit of time to actually complete the fast one already because my dps is kind of okay if you type color color max you can see the maximum damage you can actually do mine is at 376k right here the cool thing though is you can't get one shot it so you literally gotta be chilling until work others up but again it's capped the damage uh, i think 700k something like that which is pretty good, actually, but, um, yeah, it's gonna take us a minute. So, we're in wave 4 right here, and you'll see that Worker is actually gonna be the very guy. That's the only sort of, like, non-AFK wave right here, so whatever that happens, you need to put on your pros back on. That's, like, the only thing right there. Other than that, you're gonna be chilling. So far, wave 4 took me probably, like, I don't know, 10 to 15 minutes, I would say. We have 210 shots acquired, which is two keys right here. And, um, yeah, we keep going. Also, as you can see right here, we have the brand new prayers that are absolutely freaking beautiful. I'm going to put some quick prayers on as well right here. It's kind of more convenient. So, we've got the C-Ring Gaunt right here. Prevent enemies from disabling your prayers. That's really good for workers, for example, right here. Then we have this one, the Melomance one. Boost attack, strength, defense by 30%. The range one by 30%. And magic and defense by 30%. Very, very nice. Oh, sad, bro. Celestial just came up right here. I definitely want to farm so I can get my fast Celestial upgrade because I'm literally a couple thousand Celestial energy away from my fast Celestial item. But I kind of want to stay in here since we've sort of progressed a little bit, I guess. So that's pretty unfortunate. So I just missed another Celestial creature. Someone got 5,000 Celestial energy. That's the drop I'm dreaming of, to be honest. His case is also at 1,054. That's pretty fucking insane, to be honest. And, um, yeah. We keep going all the way until wave 10, which is probably going to take me roughly one hour in total. And there's a rule thump right here. If your damage is not all the way to 750k, your max hit, then you want to go until wave 10. If you got 750k, then you want to go to wave 15 to 20. So, yeah, let's see how many shots we're going to be getting. And so, it's time to cry because we've missed six freaking guardians because someone said it's going to be three only. I decided not to teleport. It was six guardians as well as the Celestia right here. But I hope it's going to be worth it, and we're going to get spooned. Hopefully, the RNG gods of Luna is going to be blessing us. I really deeply believe in it. And, um, yeah, we're away from mine right here. Two more ways, ladies and gentlemen. That was a big jump, actually. We've jumped from 1.17 to 1.4 right here. So we have 1,450 key shots right here. 
That's going to convert into 14 gold loot keys right here. Time for a little opening right here. I'm very excited. We're going to do it one by one. And hopefully we're going to get freaking spoon. It's 1 in 500, right side. We should get spoon, right? We should get spoon, please. Spam click. Please. Oh, bro. Bro, what do you mean, dude? Where is my Sonic bow stuff? My freaking Sonic orb? Or any of those? Uh, all right, well, that's the loot right here, boys. You guys can see it. And three silvers we've got, at least, I guess. Quick open those. One, two, and... Hmm, I don't know how do you feel about this, to be honest. Could have sold them as well, probably, but okay. Well, GG's. Oh, yeah, definitely good fun. Uh, you can combine this probably when you grant, like, another account at the same time. So I'm thinking to start an Iron series this week, maybe. And we're going to do Gauntlet grinds a lot on the main account with Celestial grinds, which is pretty fk -ly. At the same time, we can go out and grind a second account. I think that's freaking smart. Let me know down below. So we have a Garden Kill right here. That's because of the stream. Shout out to the boys right here. Let's go ahead and get spooned. The Garden is dead, and we've got ourselves another 25k pack. Not too shabby. So here we go. Isles grind starting right here, right now. We are... At the medium ones right now, I believe we have like 140 completions. We need 250 in total to be able to go for the heartwood. Heartwood required to get the beautiful weapon attachments, which we need to upgrade our weapon right now. And um, yeah, it's pretty straightforward. You have two bosses right here. You want to protect one of them with the beautiful mage and the other one with range. This one right here is attacking always with range and that one with mage. If you don't dodge it, you're gonna get one shot. Important to mention, also, when the HP drops to 75%, you'll not be doing any damage. As you can see right here, so you wanna attack the other one. Again, 25% down, then you go and attack the other one. Again, fire, you can go ahead and dodge it. If you have the Quiver though, like I do, this one right here, you're gonna have free Soul Split all the freaking time, which is pretty amazing. Here we go, first Celestial of the episode right here, bro. Look at the amount of people, that is absolutely freaking insane right here. Let's go ahead and slay this bad boy. Celestial creature, is that right? Hey, give me 5,000, please, 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 dude. Oh, no freaking announcement for us after the chat. Back to the old screen. So, KC totally 147. And then you can click on this beautiful god chest right here. And you can see all different rewards. If you go on and collect it, then you guys will lose your drop rate bonus right here. If you keep in the coffin, you don't die. This will go up and up from there. Rewards, as we can see right here, that's the easy one. That's the medium one. I've actually got spoon with one of those relics right here. And that's the ones we want to be farming so we can get these orbs for the next beautiful upgrade. Oh boy, we're going to get landed. I think this is best in slot gear here. Like almost best in slot right here. Huge out to strap you right here. And we will go ahead and use this for out of the guards. This is going to be hella freaking exciting. Let's see how quick we're going to do the next run right here. This is actually insane. I'm not joking. This is... Not fast. This is rapid. This is rapid. What? This is, by the way, best in slot in range as well. So, I... whoa. This will speed up a lot the runs. Let's go. Less than one minute. What the fuck? We have a beautiful Celestial up as well right here. Let's see if we can get into the top damages. But I'm actually quite late. But we never know, right? Look at that. I actually managed to get to fucking top two right here. That is crazy. Okay, we better get the 5k drop right here. Ladies and gentlemen, drop it, please. Please. Uh, zero two. Of course, I don't get shared. So we've been shredding through the freaking arts right here. Almost 160 cases, which we're going to be grinding for today. But before we go and complete the last two runs, we'll kill another Celestial one. Come on, spoon me. So the beautiful bad boy is dead, and I did not get shared again. Sad. And by the way, guys, you want to see the gear I was using for these quick runs. This entire gear right here. Corner of Spring right here. Tactic Amulet. Leviathan all right here. Zolcano Plate Body. Zolcano Plate Legs. The Dragon Bone Boots right here. Magic the Gloves. Fellfire Bay. The Scotisa Ring, which are best in slot, all of them. And Death Lotus Costume right here. Huge shout out to Mr. Strappy for lending me this gear. Look at this legend right here. All like in sub. Show some love. With that said, it's a perfect wrap right here. And that is also going to be the end of the video right here. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Huge shout out again to Mr. Strappy right here. Make sure you're joining with the links down below right now. And when you guys are looking for the first time, you should type Colin Gory Fire to the chat and with the code. Well, because you guys will get a very juicy start back. Don't forget to enter the giveaway by smashing the like button, commenting your name, stop by, and be subscribed to my channel. Thanks so much for tuning in. I love you all. Have a good one and peace out.